evening folks welcome back to haywire homestead so the kids are finishing up the barn chores for this evening and it's going to be a cold night so <laughs> there's mr alex he's a show off uh they're getting everybody some hay because it's quite chilly out it uh supposed to get down to the mid 30s again tonight which is a little unusual for october i think i've said that on i don't know how many videos okay now gabe has decided to also show off um we just had a really, really weird we year weather-wise. But I thought I'd show you what we're having for dinner. And this is my electric smoker. It's a pit boss. It uses actually a smoker pellet. Um, you can grill on it. So it's pretty uh, versatile. And I just like it because it's easy. I do have propane. I also have a charcoal stove. Or grill, rather. Um, as well as a propane camp stove. So we have multiple ways to cook things if we didn't have electricity. Obviously, this is electric. It wouldn't work. But what we have is found some all-natural St. Louis style pork ribs at the store and uh, we slow cook them and then we put them on here and we start smoking them for about two hours and I also have on there um, my homemade barbecue sauce that I make um, I know that I made a video of that and I'll put a link in the description below so that is smoking and then we'll take you inside and show you what else is for dinner Okay, so we also have mashed potatoes. These are mashed po or potatoes that I canned last year and I just mashed them up. Love using canned potatoes to make mashed potatoes. All I gotta do is dump the jar in a kettle, heat it up to boiling, drain them off, mash them, add a little bit of, um, usually I try to use a whole milk, um, preferably an organic one in there. Um, and this will be for the kids. I don't eat dairy, so I'm not able to. Uh, but this will be for the kids. We also have home canned green beans. These came out of our garden last year, so we're still working on last year's. It did so well last year. We're still working on those, so I'm heating those up. We also have some homemade applesauce to go along with, um, and that is pretty much what's going to be for dinner tonight. So we've got our smoked pork ribs, our green beans out of our garden applesauce uh, that I made myself, as well as the pot mashed potatoes, and I just thought I'd share what we're having for dinner. We do try to be as self-sustaining as possible. Uh, that means that a good bit of what we eat comes from our, our own um, garden and our own animals. If we were having chicken tonight, then the chicken would have been something that we produced. We um, do not raise hogs. It's just not something that we're in a position to do. At this point, our neighbors are a little close and I really don't feel like it would be a very good thing if we uh, raised hogs and they had to deal with the odors and things like that. They they are fine with our goats and our chickens and our ducks and our horses, but I think pigs will be pushing things a little bit too far since we are a little close um, neighbor-wise. But so that's it for now. Uh, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, hit that bell so you get notifications on when our next video is. And y'all have a good one.